What's what's going on here? What what is happening? It was like <laughs> it looked so crazy. Oh, he's pooping. <laughs> so sorry. Hello, you guys. Welcome back to a new vlog. So we have a lot, a lot to get done because in a little over a week, I am going to Florida with my mom for a vacation. I'm really excited, but like I have no idea about clothes. <laughs> After last summer, I donated a lot of clothes. I packed some away. We're gonna need to go through those. I recently did like um, a vacation-y haul with some bathing suits and stuff um, from Target and Amazon. So if you wanna watch that, I did grab a few pieces there. Um, and I also just got in like some swimwear from Good American and I just want to make sure it like fits and I like the fit of it. So I got, um, I got two one pieces. This is really cute. It's the, I think always fits collection or like fits everybody or something. I always mix those two up from Skims and Good American, but it's this really nice, like seersucker fabric, super, super stretchy. So I got that black one with the thicker straps and then this hot pink one with the spaghetti straps. It's really cute. It doesn't really have cups, but like I'm okay with that. And then I also got this bandeau top. It looks like so little. Um, like it's a wicked stretchy though. Like, like really, really stretchy. So I need to try this on too. Cause apparently they said it was like new and improved from the old bandeau. Cause I had a bandeau from Good American before. Not good. And yes, I still have <laughs> I still have the Christmas tree up in the bedroom. I should probably address that first. This is the only one up in the house. I know. It's just, it's wintry. There's no ornaments on it. It's just like a wind. I call it a winter tree. I'll take it down soon. I'll take it down. But for real, when we watch a show in bed, it is so cozy. I'm sorry, you can judge me, it's fine. Also, I got this in the mail today. I was not expecting this and I'm so excited because I've been seeing everyone playing with the Charlotte Tilbury new blush sticks. Um, so shout out, so exciting. Thank you so much Charlotte Tilbury for sending these. So we have some matte blush wands. Look at the colors. I feel like everyone uses this one, but I wanna try them all. And then we also have some hypnotizing pop shots. Easy color to make your eyes pop. Yes, because I feel like I'm gonna bring a lot of like kind of easy, creamy makeup down to Florida. Just to, like throw it on quickly, keep it dewy, keep it fresh, cover the pimples get out the door. This is just our quick little haul moment because I have a bunch of stuff on the bed I want to put away. So I'm like, I may as well show them first. So you guys will see these in motion in Florida. I had showed in the last vlog, I got some new Fabletics. My fave leggings from Fabletics are in the motion 365 fabric. They're my jam. Just like stay up totally, not a drop of see-through. Really nice material, love it. And then I got a black pair with little stripe super cute you guys will see these me wearing them in vlogs it just doesn't warrant a try on haul um and then another pair so i got three pairs of these leggings because i had some from years ago and they're really good quality too this is not sponsored but i had some from when i worked with them they're still in great shape and i wear them all the time i also got this like oversized white sweater that has like this asymmetrical hemline really pretty my favorite favorite item though which I want to wear um tonight is this PJ set they're so cute I think this was one of their like Valentine's Day collection fabrics it's like this silky hot pink with leopards so cute so these are like wide leg pants and then it has a matching button up top I'll link everything if you want to grab so so cute. I sized up on the top because I just did, I don't like any bit of tightness in the chest. I also grabbed these tanks that have like a cutout in the back. Fun, fun little uh, pattern on this one. That was in the last vlog too, the yellow one. A simple black workout tank, but this one has pockets on the sides. Like how cool is that? And this one's a fave. I don't often like to wear long sleeves though at the gym, so I don't know when I'm gonna wear this. I honestly might just wear it in general because it's like this really cute long sleeve top with a built-in bra and then the back has like an opening little twist 
just like a little bit of your back showing really fun all right so we need to pull out the summer clothes and go through them like i've been putting it off for weeks so let me go get them all right here are our summer clothes i got like a few really cute pieces from amazon like dresses a jumpsuit like i don't need that much for this trip because most of the time we're hanging out by the pool or at the ocean so we've got some old navy shorts oh these are so old but they're one of my favorite pairs of pull-on pants they're from misguided i think misguided shut down like i'm pretty sure they closed these are my favorite pull-on linen stretchy waist shorts yes the good thing is somehow losing over 100 pounds is a little like discouraging because people are always saying like that i hardly look different or whatever i feel different i feel amazing but like the good thing is a lot of my clothes were just like you know stretchy pants like this <laughs> so they still fit pretty well not everything some stuff's too big but a lot of stuff still fits and people lose weight differently so get that judgy attitude out of here got the abercrombie shorts a staple oh we got our little uh workout romper uh, i was gonna say this would be a great plane outfit but i'm also like taking that off in a bathroom on an airplane whoo absolutely not i never took the tags off of these these old navy shorts i need to try like all of this on and i just <laughs> don't want to we've got some ava and viv shorts oh this is cute this classy network top one shoulder built-in bra we love that oh these are fun these are from like one of my favorite boutiques this is just like a hangout video i hope you're okay with that <laughs> like well we're gonna keep vlogging after but i hope you're okay with just hanging out right now these hot pink pull-on shorts are definitely coming with me oh this is one of my favorite dresses from old navy i wore this in new york with yar it like it's a halter. Oh. What's what's going on here? What what is happening? And it like is a halter. So cute. I was actually poking on the old navy website and they had something like this in a romper this season. Oh, this one's nice. This is an Amazon find. It's like one of those tennis dresses with the built-in bra, built-in shorts. You know, these are the best. I'll be linking everything I wear like on Instagram and in the vlogs. Oh, this dress is so cute. This is like giving Easter vibes. It's from Old Navy. I don't think I'm gonna bring this. It's just a little, a little too fancy. Isn't it like so fun when you pull out all your old clothes? This little skirt is so vacation vibes. This is from Target. Definitely bringing that. I wore that in Miami last year. This fun top from Aritzia. I wore this in New York. It like crosses. That would look cute with that white skirt. I feel like it was all the rage last year to wear these <laughs> kind of tennis dresses with the built-in bra and built-in shorts this one's from old navy same vibe my halloween costume <laughs> i should honestly bring this my 13 going on 30 dress just wear it as a dress another classy network tank with the built-in bra we love Ooh, i'm definitely bringing this one another classy network top but it has this like one shoulder with the cutout bruno is itching himself and then of course I have more pull-on white linen shorts. These ones are from Abercrombie. <laughs> These ones are from J. Crew. It's an obsession. I love that kind of look with just like a cute little tank. Another tank top. This one's also from Classy Network. I just love all their stuff with the built-in bras. Oh, this dress was from Target last year. I love this. I love just like flowy, easy breezy dresses like this. Probably bring this one too. Got this cuta flowy baby doll tank from old navy and then another tennis dress from old navy that's it that's all the clothes that i kept i donated the rest so let's really go through this now let's really go through this okay so honestly we have a lot to work with here we have more than enough to work with like i said i'm gonna go with mostly the easy breezy vibes i don't think i've ever have i tried or tried these on <laughs> These pants are so cute. These little shorts. I love these. Are you sniffing me? Are you sniffing me? Are these too long? Are they kind of long? Or are they just right? I don't know. Okay, so these pull-on shorts are too big now. These are from Abercrombie. They're an XXL. I'll probably give them to my mom to put on Poshmark. Follow my mom on Poshmark because she posts my stuff and her stuff all the time. Okay, these J. Crew ones 
fit much better. So we will bring these. My favorite ones. These are my favorite ones. I don't know why. I think I like the thick stretch waistband. This is why you gotta try everything on before you go because I don't think these fit last year uh, and I absolutely love the fit of them now. Like they're definitely the perfect short. These are from Old Navy. They're called the slouchy straight, but we're definitely bringing these. I'm trying to think realistically how many of these like Tennessee dresses am I going to wear while I'm down there? Maybe I'll just bring like one or two. Cause like in the morning, sometimes we'll walk to breakfast. So that's kind of the vibe. Definitely packing this cute one shoulder. I'm kind of starting like a yes and no pile. We're going to say no to this. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's not very fancy where we're going. As much as I love this top, um, I like wearing it with jeans that are like, like real jeans, not shorts. So I'm going to save that for like spring. We'll bring this black tennis dress from Amazon. Definitely bringing this dress. Actually that black one shoulder would look great with this dress or skirt. I have to bring this halter from Old Navy. It's so cute. I have like a few other things in my closet that I left out, you know, that I didn't pack away for summer, like a few other tanks. So I'll go through that at some point. I just really wanted to go through this bin and it was giving me anxiety. So I'm like, I need to do this on the vlog <laughs> to give me strength. I'm gonna bring this pair of Abercrombie jean shorts. Should I bring this one too? I feel like I am gonna wear these a lot. And we're there for a whole week, so it's kind of necessary because they're probably gonna get sweaty. Can't wear it twice. All right, we've made progress. Thank you for doing this task with me. Okay, the bedroom, the mess, that's the reality of the situation right now, but um, I just tried on the pajamas. I am obsessed. So they're technically cropped, but I'm five, seven and a half, and they're like the perfect length. They're finishing up the fence, so you might hear drills, but these are so cute. They're so cute. It's like kind of a cropped length on the top, and like they have this cute little like gold charm right here and right here it's just such a nice detail real talk guys i don't work with fabletics anymore but i signed up to be a vip um and i just have a reminder in my phone <laughs> every month to skip um, if i don't want to get anything the first of the month i just go on and skip because they have such cute stuff and like if you're a vip it's way cheaper way cheaper <laughs> like i am a real real fan isn't that right bruni are you excited to run around the yard later with the fence reveal? Okay, it's about that time. <laughs> it's like four o'clock. I am going to take off my makeup for the day. So I tried on the Good American bathing suits and thank gosh I did and didn't just bring them with me hoping that they would be great because they were awful. <laughs> so I 1000% have a long torso. Um, I've got shorter legs and a long torso like Yar and I will sit next to each other He is like almost six feet tall and like I will be above him. I got a long torso <laughs> And these bathing suits, they're already that kind of bathing suit that has like the high cut above like high cut leg Coochie exposed situation, which I hate that that is trendy right now. I really don't like that. It had that hardcore, like you guys should have seen it, but I could not show you. It was like, <laughs> it looked so crazy. So no, I'm gonna return them because they were not cheap. And I was really excited because like I really loved the fabric. <sighs> it's very disappointing. So now I'm thinking like, Maybe I should get some from uh, Somersault because they have like long torso ones. I don't know. I think it was mostly the cut though because like I've bought like normal one pieces before and they were not that bad. So I don't know. I'm just glad I tried them on. So I'm going to definitely return those. Recently I got back into my cellar water. Don't ask me why. I just had the urge the other day. So I've been like trying to cleanse like just a ton since my skin's been just so miserable. But like before I would really let my acne like just get me down and just make me so sad and uncomfortable. And I'm definitely in like a better place with it now. It is true the older you get, like the less you care about things. And that might sound like kind of sad, but it's really a good thing. 
You don't let like silly things get you down anymore. Now you really focus on like what actually matters. And I think we can all agree that at the end of the day, the pimples don't matter. One thing that really helped me is like my mom told me once when I was, when I'm like just freaking out about anything. She was like, are you gonna be thinking about this on your deathbed one day? And it's just like, no, it puts things into perspective. Like this is so minute in the grand scheme of my life. I shouldn't let it take up space in my mind right now. You know what I mean? So just try not to sweat the small stuff. Try to remember what's like actually important. Also, I had talked to you guys in a vlog once recently about like, do you guys also do your full night skincare routine when you take your makeup off at like four? When you're just done going out for the day or you just wanna take your makeup off? And it makes sense, but one of you guys said uh, that it's actually better because it gives your nighttime skincare a chance to really absorb rather than just like going into your pillow. And that makes so much sense. So don't be afraid to do your nighttime skincare early. Guys, I'm like obsessed with these pajamas and I'm probably not even gonna sleep in them because like I prefer to just sleep in like a tank and shorts, but I just wanna wear them around the house. We're just gonna do our clarifying toner. And then we're gonna do some vitamin C serum from Versed. And lastly, the Belief True Cream Water Bomb. Aqua Bomb. This stuff is so hydrating and it feels so good on your skin. And we're gonna do the Drunk Elephant Shaba Complex Eye Serum to wrap it up. It's about that time of day though where the fence people usually leave and our cameras keep going off. So I think they are leaving so soon i'm gonna cook dinner and we're gonna watch servant because we're already almost through season three we are obsessed <laughs> you guys i have dinner in the oven bruno ran outside for like a whole hour a whole hour it was so magical yar and i were just out there with him playing fetch and he was just running and running he loves the fence like, he didn't try to get under it or go around it. Like, he just, I don't know. He just was super comfy. Um, and it's great because he has access to the woods. So that's where he loves to go to the bathroom. Don't worry, we check him for ticks and things. And he's also on, like, tick medicine and stuff. But we'll keep an eye on it. But, yeah, he loves the backyard. I'm so happy. Like, he was just, he truly was having the best day. And now he's so tired. Oh, so tired. Totally worth it to get the fence for him. He is so happy. Oh, he's sleeping. Look at his eye. Oh my God. <laughs> Good morning from the backyard with Bruno. Oh, he's pooping. <laughs> so sorry. Good boy. That's a good poo poo. I'm gonna have to go pick that up. But it's so awesome having this fence, you guys. Like him being able to run around. I'm not leaving him out here alone just cause I'm nervous of, I don't know coyotes or anything i'm just like no <laughs> um i supervise him but um he just like just getting the fence yesterday we've come out so many times just so he could run and he just loves it he loves to run that's a good boy and i was worried he would be like kind of thrown off of his potty schedule just because we have like a very hi baby this could be like a very regular routine now with his specific walks and places he goes but no he's like already so comfortable like i don't know and i've trained him pretty well with like the words pee pee and poo poo so when i say that he's like oh i can go potty here so oh it was a totally worthy investment because he's just been so happy he's had zoomies already like a million times i bet he slept so good last night um so yeah dreary day unfortunate <laughs> I wish it was a nice day to be outside. Yeah, what are you doing? Want to go see dad? Want to go inside and see dad? Let's go. Let's go see dad. Then don't you. Good boy. Get ready with me to go run some errands. Okay, so on today's agenda, I have a Target return. I have two other mail-in returns. One is at FedEx, one's at USPS. You guys, I'm so sad. I ordered these good American bathing suits because I'm going on vacation next week and they fit so bad. I was so excited, but they like are so high cut. Like 
My whole upper coochie was exposed. All you swimsuit companies out there, I'm begging you, can we stop with the high cut legs? <laughs> but I am proud of myself for trying it on before the trip because I almost just brought them and thought they'd be fine. I got the new Charlotte Tilbury blush wands. Let's try. I love this peachy color. It's called Peach Pop. Ooh, look at it. OMG, look at the pigment. It's so pretty, but like natural. Okay, I love the blush. I'm just adding on a little bronzer. Of course, more blush on top. I am so excited for vacation next week. I can't wait to get in the sun. Need vitamin D. Time for mascara. I love a Thrive mascara. And some gloss. Okay, I'm off to run my errands. Bye. Okay, you guys, it is time to go run our errands. So our first stop is going to be FedEx. I'm going to drop off the Good American Returns. I'm so sad because I really wanted those to fit. I wish they were just like a little bit longer because the fabric was so good. Look at my bangs doing like a flip. <laughs> All right, guys, stop number two. I have a Target return, and I need to get some travel stuff for the trip next week. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at all the cute Easter stuff. This is so cute. Oh my God, these little cups with the carrots. Oh my God, guys, this is all so cute. Look at this tray. This is the coolest tray ever. All right, we need toothpaste. I'm gonna get a couple to stock up. I need to see if these are on sale in the Target app because they're like kind of pricey and they're usually on sale. Okay, so far I got a bunch of travel stuff for the trip. I grabbed this because I love that you can just shave without shaving cream. Um, so I figured this would be perfect for the trip. We needed, well, <laughs> we, I needed dry shampoo. So I just got like an OG favorite because that living proof one is expansive, but it's so good. Um, and then I got a bunch of like mini stuff. I got waterproof mascara for the trip. I found this in the travel section. They had like a mini section, this color correcting green cream from Hero. Great to go over like pimples or redness if I get sunburned or anything. If I don't want to put on makeup, but just want to like tone down the redness. They even had a little mini, it's a 10, because my hair gets kind of dry when I'm like swimming a lot. So yeah, we're doing good. I also need to go get cream because they were out of my creamer last time we came. Look at all the cute Tupperware. It's so cute. I love the colors. This is so pretty. Why do I love that? The Holy Grail. Well, we gotta just take a peek. Also, they restocked that picture that I drove for. So <laughs> if you want it, they probably restocked it at your Target. Oh, I like that. And I love that rounded welcome mat. Oh my God, this is so cute. I also wanna put this somewhere. I just don't know where. Okay, we are back home from Target. So I wanted to show you guys what I picked up for my travel essentials and just whatever else we got at Target. You guys know I bought, <laughs> I bought the wrong lettuce. Um, it was shredded. So we needed normal lettuce for salads. You know my obsession with Target's green grapes. They are crunchy and fantastic. And of course we've got the holy grail. I thought about it after I'm like, you're going on vacation, but this lasts a long time. <laughs> oh, it's good till August, great. Okay, so if you follow me on TikTok, I actually probably already posted the reel on here too, but here is what we got. So I got this Intuition razor from Chic. Um, I love that you don't have to use shaving cream. So this is like kind of the perfect travel razor and it comes with um, two extra well, two of the shaving heads. So that'll definitely last us. Actually, maybe I'll give one to my mom because I know she's going to want to use this too. So we can both have our own like shaving heads and use the same thing. That's kind of cool. We needed toothpaste for the house. And then also just for me, I needed more dry shampoo. I just finished the one from Living Proof and it is so good, but it's so pricey. Like I will splurge on it sometimes, but like Right now, I just wanted to grab some Batiste. I don't have any waterproof mascara right now, so I got the Lash Paradise waterproof. This was a really cool find in like the mini section from Hero. It's the Rescue Bomb. It's a mini one. It's the color correcting green cream. And when I'm on vacation, especially somewhere warm, I don't wanna wear a lot of makeup unless like I feel like it or we're going out to dinner. I don't know, even going out to dinner, it's just, it's really warm. <laughs> so um, this is great to just cover pimples or redness, uh, which I struggle with. So I think this will be really, really nice for just like touching up. 
and doing a little something. I was so excited to find this mini Hydro Boost. This is like the perfect size for a week. Um, this is my favorite moisturizer, so perfect. I don't know about you guys, but I always grab a mini pack of like medicine, Tylenol, can't go wrong. <laughs> oh, I love that they had this mini, it's a 10. This stuff is so good. The Miracle Leave-In product, amazing i bought the big one before but i love they have the little one for travel because my hair gets so dry because we swim like every day so i'm washing my hair every day which i don't normally do so it's gonna get dry from the chlorine and just over washing but like i can't <laughs> i just can't not wash my hair after swimming in a pool with chlorine especially with the blonde so this is gonna be very helpful so i got two different kinds of mini shampoo and conditioner because i am gonna be washing my hair a lot um, and I have a lot of hair. So I got the Kristen S. The One Signature Shampoo and Conditioner. So this is one of our mini shampoo sets. And then the other one I got is from Monday, the Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. I've never tried this brand, so we'll see. And I also grabbed a mini bedhead, hard head hairspray extreme hold. So I got this because um, I like to slick back my hair a lot, especially, you know, when you're on vacation and your hair is like, always kind of wet half the time and just want to slick it back in like a low bun easy breezy makes it look kind of chic going to dinner with wet hair i don't know that's just like what i like to do and then i grabbed the soap and glory uh vitamin c facial wash i've used this before i really like it but just like the perfect little size i also grabbed a mini poof because i always wash with these at home and at the hotel it's just washcloths and then I'm always wanting more washcloths. And I just, I don't love washing my whole body with that. I like using these. So grab that. Oh, and this was so cute. The Versed Mini Cleansing Balm. Uh, I love the Versed Cleansing Balm. So this will be great to take off my waterproof mascara and whatnot. So, oh, how cute. This is so little. And then everything else that I'm going to be bringing is stuff I already have at home. Like, I'm not going to buy a mini deodorant. There's honestly like certain things you can just bring it's just not to take up too much space and i'm also getting low on like moisturizer the cleansing balm i have right now i just don't love so um this is like just perfect yeah so i'm gonna bring like my normal size deodorant um i have like covers for my toothbrush um bring, bring like normal toothpaste just stuff like that because not everything warrants a mini but like minis are fun <laughs> so anyway that's the target haul of the day i can't believe the trip is coming so soon i feel like my mom and i planned this trip so long ago and now it's like almost here and i'm like oh <laughs> but I can't wait to get in the sun. Well, you guys, that was all the prep for this vlog. I will be doing more vlogs with like packing and lots of vacation content and stuff coming up. So don't forget to subscribe and hang out. Follow me on Instagram, cause that's where I'll be posting. I was thinking about doing like mini vlogs every day on TikTok too. I don't know, we'll see. Vlogging is number one priority, you guys. But I love you so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you again very soon. Bye.